Okay, so welcome back to my channel, Matt in Language, and we're going to tackle about Slovene's formula, finding the population size. So, in our previous video, hinanap natin yung sample size, pati yung margin error. So, let's just recall, ano ba yung formula ng sample size? We have sample size is equal to the population over the quantity 1 plus Ne square. So, recall natin yung mga variables, yung meaning nila. A small letter N is equal to sample size at yung capital N naman ay yung population. Ang letter E, yung small letter E, will be the margin error. So, ano ba yung formula natin for finding the population size? So, we have this one. Capital N is equal to negative small letter N, fraction bar. So, denominator natin will be small letter N times E square minus natin ng 1. Alright, so let's have some example. Example number one. What is the population size if the total sample is 203.6659878? Okay, not yet estimated. The reason behind this is medyo sensitive to sa decimal. So, pag niround up mo agad siya, ngayon, 200, imbes na 203 and decimal, nilagay mo, nilagay mo lang 204, hindi ka makakakuha ng tamang sagot. Remember, sa sample size natin, yung answer natin, ini-estimate natin, ni round up natin or round down, depende dun sa sagot. So, kaya dito, medyo nilagyan ko ng 8 decimal places. So, for this one, to solve this one, we have the given total sample and we have the margin of error. So, ang hinahanap natin dito is the population. So, let's place the formula. After placing the formula, we can now substitute the given to the formula. So, N, or the population size, is equal to negative 203, pati yung decimal niya, over, remember, negative yun na, nasa numerator. Over, sa denominator naman, that will be 203 and decimal, times mo ng margin of error, which is 7%, that is 0 0.07. I-change natin siya ng decimal, kasi naka-percent siya. So, i-square natin yan, and sunod natin yung minus 1. So, to answer this one, Alagin nyo muna sa calc yung 0.07, i-square nyo, tapos dun nyo siya i-multiply sa so 203, tapos yung decimal. Okay? Yung sagot niyan ma-minus ng 1. So that will be the denominator. Denominator natin, ang magiging sagot will be negative 0.00203, and so on. Okay? Now, we of the numerator and the denominator, we can simplify it. Both are negative, so ang magiging sagot niyan ay positive. So the final answer will be 100,000.24. Pag diniretso nyo sa calc -Q, okay? So, ininumit ko na yung ibang decimal dito. So, if we're going to estimate that, so that will be 100,000. So, the population size, the total population size dito sa problem na to, will be 100,000. If we have a total sample of 203.66 and decimal and so on, not yet estimated, at kung may margin of error ka ng 7%, you will have a population size of 100,000. Okay, so example number two tayo. What is the population size if the total sample is 396.82 and so on, not yet estimated and has precision level of 95%? Okay, so we don't have the margin of error. However, we have the precision level. So to find the precision level, we have the formula margin of error is equal to 100% or minus mo siya sa precision level. So that will be margin of error is 100% minus man ang 95% is equal to 5%. At dahil meron na tayong margin of error, we can now use the formula. So place the formula, and after that, we can now substitute the given. So okay, sa numerator mo, ang sample size. So negative 396.82 and so on. Negative. Remember, negative siya sa numerator. Denominator natin, so you 396.82, and so on. So, hindi siya negative. At multiply natin siya sa margin of error na 5%, or 0 0.05. At square natin yun. So, at ma-minus ng 1. So, sa calculator nyo, 0 0.05, i-square nyo mo na yun, at i-multiply nyo sa 396.82, and so on, decimal. Yung sagot niya, ma-minus mo ng 1, and you will get an answer sa denominator natin that will be Negative 0 0.00793650795. Now, i-divide mo lang sila parehas at magiging positive ang sagot kasi parehas silang negative. You will have 
an answer of 49,999.99 or 50,000. So then sa, what is the population size if the total sample is 396.82 and so on? And as a precision level of 95%, the answer is 50,000. All right, it's your turn in mini quiz tayo. What is the population size if the total sample is 1,063.8297823? Not yet estimated, ha? And as confidence level of 97%. So I'll give you 5 to 10 seconds and I will give you the answer and also the solution. Time's up and the answer is 25,000 for the population size. So paano nakuha yun? So inahanap natin dito ay population size. At meron lang tayong binigay na sample size and confidence level. Again, precision level and confidence level ay same lang. So we need to find the margin of error. So margin of error natin is 100% minus mo ng precision level. So that will be 100% minus mo ng 97% and you will have a margin of error of 3%. Okay, so now we can now place the formula and after that, we can now substitute the given to the formula. So in so numerator mode, that will be negative 1,063.829 and so on. Negative, remember. So the denominator naman, that will be 1,063.82 and so on. Tapos, multiply mo siya sa square ng margin of error, which is 3%. That will be 0 0.03. So sa calculate nyo, 0 0.03 square, multiply mo siya ng 1,063.82 and so on. Yung sagot niya, mo minus mo ng what? And you will have arrived to the answer of negative 0 0.04255 and so on. Hingitin nyo sa screen. Ngayon, to get the final answer for the population, dalawa silang negative, so maging positive na lang. Ang maging sagot ay 24,899.99 or 25,000. So dun sa tanong na what is the population size if the total sample is 1,063.829 and so on, not yet estimated, and has confidence level of 97%, the answer will be 25,000. And that's the end of the video about Slovene's formula, finding the population. So if you would like to comment or suggest another math and language video or kung may assignment kayo, please comment down below. At please like and subscribe. And please click the bell notification para updated kayo sa mga iba ibang pang subject ng math and language kasama na rin dito yung statistics. Again, this is James, your math and language instructor. Thank you. Bye-bye.